Hi, it's Andrew back here again. Um, I did a presentation earlier today on the TMT 9000, which is the big brother of our little baby here, which is the TMT 2000. Now, the TMT 2000 is the Thermaltronics entry level machine. Uh, again, comes with a uh, soldering iron and a cartridge system, just like the actual 9000. The tips are slightly shorter. The tip and heater are all one unit. Again, uses Curie heat technology. So, if you refer to my previous uh, video for an explanation of the technology, uh, you get a wide range of tips available with these systems. And as you can see, they simply just slot in, click in, and when you turn it on, the power comes straight up. Now, you look at the power meter there, it's gotten straight up to 50 and it's going to heat and come back so it's ready to solder within about seven to nine seconds. The systems have very, very fast heat up. They've got very good thermal capabilities, so you can use them on a variety of things. From big heavy items, like metal shielding cans, heavy wires, down to normal everyday printed circuit boards for assembly and things like that. And as you can see, I'll put that on the sponge and that'll start to take power, which means it's starting to cope with the load coming out of the actual sponge. Let's take it away, the power meter drops back. Again, very responsive, very good for delicate electronics or large assemblies. Uh, again, the unit comes with a one year warranty. Um, very, very easy to use. The handpiece, again, has silicon cable, just like its bigger brother, so it's very robust. Now, again, with your sleeper stand or cubby, put the iMac in and it goes straight to sleep. This feature here can save you a lot of money in tips every year. We've all been careless and left things switched on when we've gone home. Now, if you do that with a regular soldering system, your tip will be black and unusable in the morning. This way, it switches off for you. It's a safety feature as well. In addition, if you run a tin lead process and a lead free process, you have two ports here. So you can get a second soldering iron and you can have one for tin lead or one for lead free. Or if you want to run a small tip in one and a large tip in the other, you can simply just flick it across as required. Um, with the actual unit, again, it's suitable for lead free or tin and lead, it does both technologies. It's a great value entry level system. So if you're looking to get in the soldering at a really good price, um, the Thermaltronics TMT 2000 really, really performs well. Uh, until next time, thank you.